So I thought I'd have a go at running my Cell 1530 Junior. I picked this up for 30 quid, terrible photos on eBay, probably purposefully because as you can see the safety valve is at rather a crazy angle. Let's see if we can zoom in on that a bit. So something's being dropped on it and the safety valve itself is bent. So um, I've put the one in from my 1550. So now I'm going to oil it. I have to oil before. Where did you put your oil can, John? I have to oil before I heat it because some of the oiling points are inside the boiler. Which is when the advantage of having a Having an oiler with a long nozzle, obvious. Oops. Let's do it all in one go, I guess. Can't get in there. T diminutive little uh, piston on this thing. It is minute. Okay, now of course, what should you always do when you put an engine away? Make sure all the water's out of it and you've dried the boiler as much as possible. And what does this boiler have in it when I just opened it? First time since I got it? Water. Heaven knows how long ago. So someone was a very naughty engine user. Right. So, time to fill up a... I don't have the right cell burner for this, I'm going to have to get one. Okay, so I discounted using a mammoth burner, because it's huge, compared to the size of this boiler. So instead, I'm using this funny little thing I got, with another engine, and half an S-bit. Okay, water bubbling past the safety valve. Please excuse the background noise, if you hear singing and so on. There's a bit of a party going on in the village today. Optimistic. Come on, baby, you can do it. Okay, I've increased the height of the heater, the burner, with a handy spare Walesco pulley. So let's see if this persuades it to run a little bit more of a lick. Ah, oh, that's more like it. Mm. 
Wow. What a beast. I'm sorry, engine. I'll take the piss out of you. Yeah, that's more like it, isn't it? Yeah, safety valve is hitting steam. Oh, good AV. Yeah, that's the end of that then. Well, that's... <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Piston decided he couldn't cope <laughs> with the speed. Oh. <laughs> I pushed it beyond its design capabilities. <laughs> oh dear, it feels cruel. But, you know, you've got to find out where your limits are, otherwise you don't get anywhere, do you? So I think that's the end of the run with <laughs> Junior 1530. It was probably, his party trick is brilliant, I've got to say. I, <laughs> I really admire that, the spunk, the force with fire the piston across the kitchen table. Just wonderful. So thanks for watching viewers and uh, I hope you enjoyed that. Bye bye.